Hello, hello, a slightly longer one. Um, this time round, we've got a few more things to check. So we're gonna look at the core token and there are nine cards that will create this, including the squad commander. And you can see here, this, this is, has um, a link, a hyperlink that says core, and then an older card like captain's claw, it just describes it and says it summons a one one core ally token. So one of the things we need to check um, is, is it the same token? This is Conqueror's Pledge, which can put 18 of them uh, in play. Nahiri will put some into play. Oath of Gideon puts four into play. Um, again, these are the older cards that say 1-1 one, one core ally token. Oh, Secret Rendezvous is just there to do some draw. Um, I don't have one of the cards, which is um, a Gideon Vanguard. Um, but I've got all the other eight and I've put them all in this deck. So what we're going to do is we're going to put both types of card into play. The ones that say core ally token um, and text and the ones that have core as hypertext. Uh, and we're going to see um, what we get and what comes into play. So here's the first type. Um, we can put Oath of Gideon into play and that's going to make some core tokens for us. Uh, if we can make a swap, there we go, a five swap, that's nice. Oath of Gideon, and there's our core tokens, four of them stack up. So let's have a look at the token first of all. Uh, it's called Core, it's white, it's 1-1, one, one. it's common, and it has the creature type Core, Ally, Soldier, Warrior. So that's really, really good. You can find some good leaders, um, and that will stack nicely. I really like this style of artwork. This is by Jeremy Wilson, who's done what, 25, 30 different magic cards. Um, some of them have definitely made their way into Puzzle Quest, um, but it's a really nice kind of graphic comic style of artwork. Um, that big kind of colour, uh, geometric colour slash behind the, um, the character standing in the foreground. Cards you might know that he's done include Insidious Roots from the current set, and Dreams of Steel and Oil from Brothers War. So yeah, really good artist, really like this kind of work. Now, the next thing we need to test, um, we might need to skip forward a bit here, is if we put one of the cards into play that has the hyperlink for core, or the link, it's not really a hyperlink, is it? Um, is that gonna produce the same type of tokens as the one we've got on the board right now so we need to draw conqueror's pledge or squad commando will do it nicely so let's get squad commander into play and we'll see if that's uh, the same card and the same token and then if that's right that's our job done so i think we can get it into play this turn yeah we can there we go right squad commander down you come uh, that's another card causing landfall squad commander comes into play and it's the same token, so that's really good news. So nine cards make core tokens for us, uh, and there it is.